It looks like we're going to do trail one. Maybe I can redeem myself because I'm riding like dog do today. I'm riding so bad, it's like one of those times that you should just go home, you know? Trail two kicked my butt the last couple weeks ago. I rode up it like it was nothing. What is my problem today? Okay, I need to just calm down. And ride like I know how to ride. Oh, here we go. Hard and narrow. This thing up here, it's two again. The little, the little fuck thing. Yeah, you know, I did two like a couple weeks ago and I rode right through it not without one issue. Yeah. And to wait till you see the video of me going up that. I was all over the place. That's just how I go. I mean, last time I went up this, it took us a while because I got stuck on the last waterfall section. When I ride like this, days like this, I usually load up and go home. <laughs> you gotta do something that's harder and do it better. But I'm gonna I'm gonna redeem myself this time. Yeah last time we were up here the big waterfall at the end I got stuck on that it took us like 35 minutes. Yeah get out of that. That's the, the time before that it only took us 12 minutes to get through the entire thing. Wow. That was it. Crazy. Like crazy if you it's just insane how much difference it makes mentally if you're gonna if you think you're gonna make it up or not. Okay, Anderson, you need to ride like you know how to ride. Damn it. Struggle is real. What'd you say? The 12 year old is doing better than me. He's a good rider. <laughs> Let's see if I can do it without my goggles fogging up. Our tires are going to get wet. That's just going to make it harder. Come on, dude. get there from there. Okay. Up over that. What I'm thinking, yeah. Right here. Yep. Come on, Anderson. Thank you. 
in fogging up.